This here is a Victor Jr. for a big block Chevy. Four fifty four R Victor Jr. by Elder Brock. It's a good intake. Forty one fifty flange relatively clean casting these things have been a favorite for years they work surprisingly well too I've seen them compared to others on dyno test and there's been a few of them that surprised me. Which on a 700 horse 505 big block, this intake was within a couple of horsepower of this intake. But on an 850 horse engine, I'd say the big Brodix would pull a pretty good lead on it. But it just goes to show that you got a whatever power range you're trying to achieve, your shit needs to match. So these intakes here. Shine 650 700 horse range, maybe 750. I remember reading an article about uh, what's his name, runs the West Tech Dino, Steve Brule. He built a 496. About 20 years ago, used the same intake here, used a 1000 CFM HP Holly. and a big roller cam, but he made 780 horsepower using one of these on a 496. Hell, I think the fucking thing was pump gas friendly. It might have been nudging 12 to 1, but with the cam and shit in it, the person could have drove it around on 93. Steve Brule, he's a bad motherfucker. He knows his shit. His favorite engine is the big block Chevy. That says a lot. He can got access to build any type of engines he wants. And he chooses big block Chevys for himself. And there's a guy who knows. So there's your Classic Victor Jr. for a big block Chevy. That's a damn good piece. So they're good past 700 horse. There you go.